What's up guys and welcome back to the video today we have set for overdress uh we got two sneak peek little bundles so that means we get five packs per bundle and then we each get a um special pack so we get two of those so we're gonna go ahead and open this um don't forget to uh, like comment and subscribe and uh let me know what you're looking for in set four of overdress is this a hot skip for you um let me know um, I am personally building two decks, so I'm building Bath Sarga and I'm building Magnolia. The only issue is that all of the Dragon Empire stuff sold out a long time ago. So this is why we're here with the sneak peek, just trying to get those last cards that we um, obviously couldn't get, which was all of them. So this is the first pack. Let's get into it. Uh, Delbyth. We got Beeble. Um, we also got, this is basically like your Angly, which was like, it was on retire, give another unit plus 5k for Stoikia. This is, uh, just power creep at its finest plus 10k when you retire it. Uh, we got Ghost Bulk. <laughs> I like the art on this. Uh, choose up to two cards. Uh, my bad. Choose up to two grade two or greater normal units from your drop and put them at the top of your deck in any order. That's kind of cute. We also have the Ursurp Dragon. We did get a Dragon Empire draw trigger. We do need these. And we also got, um, looks to be some Hex Orb support. I keep getting this when I open packs. Maybe it's time to build Hex Orb. But very beautiful triple rare, so we take those. Mm, yeah. Let's go ahead and get into the second pack. I'm actually going to take a moment here and adjust my mic, so hopefully that helps. And let's go ahead and get to the second pack. Of course, we did bring the scissors this time for this pack opening. Sorry for those who were horrified by the um, uh, token Rambu pack opening. That was a little scary. Um, but yeah, we got uh, Belanca, more Stoikea stuff. We also got a X. I can't say that name. I'm not going to try. <laughs> uh, Gitaos. Piani. We got a uh, another Lathia. That's our second one. Oops, sneak peek. This is that PBD support. Phantom Blaster Dragon. I don't think no one really plays the new stuff. And then we got some um, Greedon support. I don't know if this is one of the ones you can play in other stuff, but... Beautiful double rare. Let's kind of zoom in on that. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Not as good as the first pack, but we take those. Okay, pack number three of 12. Yeah, 12 packs. Again, definitely looking for the Dragon Empire stuff and the Stoikea stuff. So, you know, Magnolia is where you at. Oh, uh, we have a Catenio, a Lem, it's a Lemur for Soikia. Yeah. This gets pretty big, but it's a CB, so if you're not playing counter charges in your deck, kind of sus. Um, not going to try to say this one. There is a hit. So the uh, Shikshanya, um, if you play a bunch of orders, you can use this to kind of filter, get a nice hand size with... Uh, nice guard cards and important pieces and it's a 15k beater on the turn you do do the filter uh nonner uh more pbd support and we have the spear for bob sarga i think these are going for like a dollar to three dollars right now at the time of recording this video gotta love those pre-release sales they will drop i promise you they will <laughs> so overall some pretty good hits so far um definitely cards i wanted to see we got um, two more packs in this first bundle. Okay, let's get to it. Throw the pack somewhere, I'll deal with it later. All right, so we have a uh, Shakugan. This is um, one of those gold Vanguard orders. I don't know why they do this. I find it quite funny. Um, but I think like almost every grade three for Overdress has a order where it's gold for some reason. 
um, Negrita. We got Wade, Diablos Jetter. Don't know if you play this, but it looks cool. Uh, Tonya, instead of uh, like the uh, one of the prior cards, Tanya. And here is the 10K, oop, not gonna reveal that too soon. Here's the uh, 10K shield draw trigger for Brant. Gotta love it. And oh boy, it's a Bastion Prime. Any Bastion appreciators in the comments? Um, yeah, if you're a Bastion appreciator, let us know. Also, we do have a Twitch, so you know if you happen to have the Amazon Prime, you can go ahead and get the free Bastion Prime sub if you know what I mean. So, there's that. That is the first bundle. And now we're on to the second bundle. Very hype. It's been weird with the release of Master Duel and then reveals for V Collection basically being done. Um, premium players are testing more stuff. Um, Vanguard players are playing Yu-Gi-Oh! It's a really weird time. There's, I feel like there's not enough time to go through all the stuff I want to talk about with you guys. So, of course, I, I try to get to as much as possible. If you guys have noticed, the channel's kind of become this um, like three-tier channel where we have the Zero, we have the TCG for Vanguard, and then we also have the TCG for, well, not the TCG, but we have the OCG Client Master Duels now where I'm doing some content for that. Um, it gets a little hard to juggle, so if there's anything you guys ever want me to talk about in a video, you guys can let me know in the comments below. Check this out. Talk about Gold Vanguard Orders. This is the Zorga one. It gives it an extra drive, which means Zorga could potentially um, heat and delete an opponent real quick. Uh, we're talking like first grade three turn, uh, first uh, or on your grade two turn even, it can get really scary. This is a very good order. I always get high rolled by Zorga, so I don't know about y'all, but it's definitely my, my demon deck, the deck that always sneak attacks me in bracket. I don't know why it does, but it's, it's just always been that way. I realize I actually have an extra pack, so we didn't have five left, we had six. Oopsie. Um, we'll kind of just go through. Anything spicy? Um, Kuke, which it looks like it's a, it's a 13k booster, but it's conditional. I don't know. And then we got this Embrace Dragon for Keter for Keter. Uh, at least it looks cool. I don't know if anyone's going to play this. It's also a 12k base. I'll take a look at this later. Uh, yeah. So again, one, two, three, four pack. So we're going to go with this one. Make sure those are off to the side. Also, now that token Rambu, the ones who are hyped for it, you know, the sets didn't really pop off too well. And I still like my waifu map more, so you guys will probably see this map more often on the channel. But um, getting the token Rambu stuff made me realize I probably don't need to buy infinite amount of mats. Um, like maybe the one to two I do have now is good enough. So I'll try to stick to just buying the, the card product and buying more of it rather than getting play mats. Uh, greed on stuff. Incoming, oop, that's a sneak peek. And there we go, here's Brucey. Well, this is cool. I know, I know a couple of Bruce players. I personally don't play Bruce, but I know that this is tackable and some Bruce builds and you can kind of do some cool stuff with it. So it's always nice to see them give um, decks with solidified uh, builds more options because then it just means the format becomes more creative. So gotta love it. Still nothing too amazing yet from these early packs, just mostly triple rares. I mean, we've hit two of the right lines, so that's pretty sure I made my money back, but I'm not really concerned with that. Hopefully, this, as long as someone that I know needs them and I can help them build their decks, it's probably gonna be good enough for me. Uh, this is the Draconic Overlord Gold Order, but it's not hollow like the others. I hate to see it. Lava Wire Dragon. Got um, a Gravidia card, Gravidia a B. And there is the Stoic AI draw. So I already, I ordered a, um, a case uh, or nation split for Stoic AI, So I don't need this. So I'll be sending this off to someone who potentially needs it. And then we get a um, Helheim Fervent Rage. Another Bruce order. Let's go. Uh, we got two 
more of the normal packs, and then we'll kind of go over the promos. I actually remembered to get the promos this time when I got my sneak peeks, uh, which was not the case the first time. Um, <laughs> let's see, uh, we got Stefani. Uh, this is uh, just a booster for Bob Sarga. I'm gonna try to center this. Sorry if it's not been centered this video. I swear I'll get good at this eventually. Here is the cutter draw. So I've based, it looks like I'm on track to hit at least one of each, which is kind of cool. We take those. And there we go, boys. We pulled the Magnolia. It is triple rare, but it is still a very gorgeous card. Just look at that. Um, Magnolia was actually the first overdress deck I built. It was my gateway into the TCG, if you will. So really happy to, you know, finally see the deck in a good place. Definitely um, in a much better place than it was in set one. I'll say that much where it was, you're hoping a high roll. You're hoping just to rush and your opponent didn't hit defensives. Um, it did have a good bash and mash up in set one, but set two and set three mag was a little bit of a struggle street. Um, so lightning how, and I guess that did force me to kind of, you know, move around to other decks, but it's time for me to make my return. Here is the Flagberg gold Vanguard order. Um, this, it gives your Flagberg plus 20k. I don't know. Usually the rears are small, but it looks gorgeous. I think these the, the art concept on these orders is quite cool. I think that's enough for me. More duds. More dud cards. More dud cards. Oh, that's the last card. Hmm? Wait, that, that's it? Just a... You know, we get those every once in a while. It's fine. <laughs> Alright, so those are the... Those are the main packs. We're gonna get to the um, the promos and stuff that you get along with your sneak peeks. I got two of each because, well, I got two. Let me let me get that random OTT card I, I bought out of here. So yeah, they give you more of these um, generic OTs. And then you get, um, this is like the promo for the sneak peek. It's called, um, let me see if I can zoom in on that and get, and let the camera focus. So it's Alexi, and basically what she does is when this attack, um, when this unit boosts, um, English is hard. When this unit, when the attack this unit boosts hits a Vanguard, you can Soul Blast one and bind this unit. Choose a Blitz order from your drop and put it into your hand. I don't know if Zorga really needs this, but I think this does leave us room for growth later on. So right, we take those. And yeah, great OT. Uh, I do not need more of those, but if I get more friends into this game, then hey, I'll take those. So now we're on to the the Unka Bunka packs. Um, for the pre-release, you'll get five basic, and then they'll give you one like stack pack, so you don't feel like you wasted your money. And it helps you build decks. Um, let's see if we get anything super spicy from this. Oh, it is not centered. <laughs> okay, uh, Dark Deceptive Diving, wow, would you look at that, that is an SP, uh, Quegra, I, I can't say this, is this, is this, um, Barrel Magnus? Yeah, this is Barrel Mag, oh wow, that's, that's gorgeous, I, I don't know what to say, well then, just look at that foiling. You take those. Uh, beautiful SP. Vero Magnus is uh, definitely in a really good spot right now between last set and this set. So good on Vero Magnus for being good again. I remember like after set one, it kind of like disappeared off the face of the plane. I was really confused because I thought the deck would have a little bit more longevity, but at least it was cheap for players getting into the game. Finally, we have the final pack. Last pack magic. Give me the spicy cards. Four for four. Okay. I believe I have one more card in here. Okay, and we have a Hexa Orb SP. I'm gonna be honest, I always love pulling SPs, but these are not the SPs we wanna see. 
um, but beggars aren't choosers. I had a lot of fun opening this and we still did get a lot of things that could help other people at locals. I also got a couple of Bob Sarga pieces. So at the end of the day, you know, what you get is what you get. Um, that is the gotcha life. But that being said, guys, uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more Vanguard content. Um, this is Kakord and TCG signing off. Peace out.